Okay, we are back. Here's a... Uh, Here's a lovely, lovely young actress, Farrah stars in a television movie called Criminal Behavior, which airs next Monday, May 11th, as they say, on another network. Probably not too difficult to find since there are only three of them. Would you welcome, please, Miss Farrah Fawcett. Ah, oh, kisses all, kisses for everybody. Yeah. You're Don't, so funny. Thank you. <laughs> You're wasn't so that, funny. Wasn't that great? Yeah. Wasn't that lovely? Both of you. Nice to see you. You're <laughs> <laughs> Thank well, you. Well, I did it again to you, didn't I, before the you show did. You did, you did. And then everyone came in. I should never right. do it. It's not fair. She was in makeup and getting the hair done and curlers, and I knock on the door to say hi. And you were graciously let me in. I'm, I'm sorry. A, a, a sarong yeah, a loose, towel. A little towel around <laughs> your, uh, your top yes. part? Yes. How you doing? Good. Good to see you. Good. Thank you. When you were doing, uh, in the early days, Charlie's Angels, mm -hmm. did you think it was going to be tough to break out of that? You know, because you come on and do some wonderful work that is the burning, the burning bed uh -huh. that you did, and you did some remarkable work. But wasn't it kind of tough to break out of the... You know, they say, oh, she's only going to play the little, you know, silly role in Charlie's Angels. Yeah, I... Probably then I didn't realize yeah. it. I only realized it as I left the show and then went on. I mean, you know, I just... I think I didn't give things a lot of thought. <laughs> You know, wasn't that show originally I'm called glad somebody? I didn't, I... Wasn't that originally called Alley Cats? The original oh, it was. title for that show? That's right. Did you know that? This is just a historical uh, note here. <laughs> but... I did not know that. Well, I, I did not know it either. <laughs> Let's ask the audience. So that's, the audience. that's what I wanted, just a little rhythm there to yeah, bounce right. off of and uh, get these blank stares. Look, and I don't know why I brought that up, but, <laughs> but Charlie's Angels... I just was... thought I was home watching on TV. Uh, did you, yeah. you didn't have to answer. No, no, you're, you're here now. You're part of this. Uh, <laughs> uh, um, this is good. It's sort of... Uh, loose. Bad? Loose, loose. loose. thank no, you. No, not, not bad, just kind of, kind of loose. Yes. You were a Charlie's Angel for a while. <laughs> I was, yes. Yes, I, I did it. I did it for yeah, a while. Yeah, we both, we With both, the things coming out of the it. Um, <laughs> oh, what was I talking about? Um, Anything? Alec. 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 Well, don't forget that. You got a, you got a young son who's, what already, seven, eight? He just turned seven. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Does, now, he can't go see most, most of your work, can he? Because it's rather oh. adult. You know, like the... well, it's not... Yes, I guess it is adult smashing, bashing, yeah. burning people. No, he hasn't seen a lot of it. In fact, he went to... Um, I was filming in Canada, and I had him in a little camp. <laughs> wow! <laughs> and um, so one of their little expeditions was to go to a video store. Right. So we came home, and I came home from work about 8 o'clock, and he said, Mommy, did you burn a man in a bed? <laughs> but, you know, he didn't... I don't even think he realized what he was saying. And I said, well, no, I didn't, but I was acting. Yeah. You know, so it's hard for him. Is he I able mean, to... he thinks everybody's is he able to... on he's, TV. He's able, that is, isn't he, to separate reality from... Or is he not? I think, I think he is, but there's always a question in the back of his mind. You know, when we were having the problems here in L.A., right. I, I sat him down and I wanted him to watch it. It was when the Koreans had the guns. Yeah. You know, it was... I, I was actually trying to figure out if they were undercover cops or if these right. were, you know just regular people, and he said, is this America's home videos, Mom? So, you know, yeah. there's so much of uh, home he videos. He couldn't separate the real violence from what you see on television. Yes, he thinks everything is not real now. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Now, so, the picture's called uh, Criminal, what is it? Criminal Behavior. Yeah, now, is this uh, um, not a... Not a comedy, obviously. Well, so some parts of it are funny, yeah. funny. <laughs> it's, uh, it's based on a Ross MacDonald novel. Right. Do you know... His work, you know, it's sort of like Ra Raymond Chandler right. writes a lot about Los Angeles. And um, it's not, um, I mean, I don't get beaten or right. abused or it's kill nice for, anyone or burn anyone. Nice for change. But it's, uh, yeah, so it's, yeah. it's uh, fun. Are you still a racquetball nut? I think we talked about that mm. once. I have a court, so I, I play. Right. A lot. And what about somebody about the, you like boxing? Now, most what? women get turned off by <laughs> boxing, and I understand you're a boxing well, Now, Don't we have George Foreman coming up uh? Oh, Coming he's so sweet. Isn't he a nice man? He's so sweet. He wore one of my tank tops. We did a show together, and he didn't have one, so I had a lot. He wore one of your tank tops? Yes, yes, yes. Come on, give me a break. The man weighs 240 pounds. No, it was very tight, you know. Yeah, I would guess so. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so I have that. Anyway, um, boxing. I, I hit the bag in this in this film that I do. Yeah. So, uh, I like I like to hit the bag, and I like. But when I watch boxing, I, I don't. I feel sorry for the one who loses. You know, somebody always has That's to lose. That's usually because he's unconscious. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Or 
when they start hitting them. Well, so I'm get a sympathy vote. Yeah. <laughs> right. Kind of hit the so. bag. It sounds like a euphemism for smoking marijuana, doesn't it? Yeah, hit the, anyway, hit the, the bag. bag. <laughs> 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 yeah, I mean, hitting a bag. It's a hypocrite. Does that, does um, that, what does that release attention or hostility or something? Amazingly, it does. Yeah. Are you basically yes. a calm person? What do you do when you get angry? Hit the bag. Oh, hit the sorry. bag. <laughs> hit, hit something. Throw, no, no, no. You know what? It's, I, I have such respect for, for men and men who step into the ring because I took this class. It's called a, a boxer size class. You have to walk. Boxer size? Boxer size. You put on the gloves and what you do is you either jump rope or you, you know, hold your arms up and hit the bag for three minutes. I mean, by the time, you know, a minute and a half, I was going, no, 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 I'm tired, no. Yeah. So it was great, you know, yeah. we, you do it for 10 rounds, and then at the end of the class, you sort of crawl away. Is that the way you get your... Um... Hostility out? No, I really don't. Go. A racquetball is how I get my yeah. hostility out. Do we have a little... Are we, are we allowed to show a, a, a clip of a... Uh, we're not? We don't. And we such have great none? shots of How boxing. dare somebody <laughs> show up on this program without a film clip? <laughs> what, what is that? that? I guess it's because it's on another network. Another network. Hmm. Uh, what network's it on? I've only got ten more shows. Well, <laughs> what do I care? <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> what are they going to do? Mm. What are they going to say? You, sorry, right. you can't You're do the fine. last eleven. <laughs> you mentioned another network. ABC. 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 How about that? <laughs> Like they couldn't find it anyway. Yeah. Somebody told me where you, you went to school where in high school? I went to uh, Corpus Christi, W.B. Ray High School. Somebody told me because... No, you couldn't be. <laughs> somebody told me that the, the, the yearbooks, uh, the year you went there, uh, people were taking them as souvenirs, true? Yes. Isn't that sweet? Yeah, that's sweet. That's, I didn't like my picture in it, though. So I Does anybody like their picture in their high school? You I look back know. at it, we all, you all look so, so uh, jerky. Yeah, yeah, strange. You know how they have the ones match them up? Have yeah. you ever seen those? No, I still, I look like mine, unfortunately. Yeah. Anyway, I wish, you, I wish you much luck on, on the picture coming Thank up. you. It's, I'm so happy to be here with you. Before Thank you. Before you uh, go. Off, right off in the sunset. Right off, yeah. We'll be right back. Stay where you are. Yeah. On ABC? No. <laughs> it's Monday, 9 o'clock. Anyway, thanks for we'll being here. We'll miss you. Well, I, I thank you for coming. And Steve? We've been friends for many, many years, and every time you come on the show, you always come prepared. You come up with something original. I'm very grateful to well, you. Thanks. I'd like to thank Melissa Hurley, who helped me do Flydini, too. Melissa young Hurley is the young lady who helped the Flydini. Thank you much, Steve. Tomorrow night, Buddy Hackett, Madeline Kahn, and the songs of Diane Shearer. Good night. <laughs>